okay question X uh, a windows has a perimeter 20 meter and uh, find the length of the side of the rectangle when the area is the maximum okay okay first uh, information the perimeter of the windows here equals to the uh, 20 meter And uh, the area here is uh, maximum, okay? So the maximum, uh, when the first derivative uh, of the function here, uh, shape of tangent here increase, uh, horizontal or decrease, or using the second derivative test, uh, the sign of the first derivative here uh, less than zero, yeah? Okay, uh, first you draw the uh, rectangles and the uh, height of the uh, uh, windows here equals to the y meter and here equals to the uh, x meter. Okay, so the perimeter here equals to the x plus x uh, plus y and plus y and uh, perimeter equals to 2x uh, plus uh, 2y and the uh, perimeter of the windows here equals to the 20 meter and uh, equals to the 2x uh, plus uh, 2y yeah and uh, this equation uh, divided by 2 okay and uh, 10 here equals to the x uh, plus y yeah okay so you write down the y here in terms of x uh, y equals to the 10 uh, minus x yeah so uh, first here uh, using the first method so first method y here in terms of x okay uh, step two uh, you find the first derivative uh, the area of the rectangle here equals to the uh, x uh, time y okay and uh, you substitute uh, y here into the area so x uh, times uh, 10 minus x so the area of the windows equals to the 10x minus uh, x square yeah so this area uh, in terms uh, of x okay and uh, you find the first derivative uh, dA over dx uh, equals to the 10 uh, minus uh, 2x. Okay, so uh, you let the first derivative here equal to the 0 and uh, 10 minus uh, 2x equal to 0 and uh, find the value of x. So x here equals to the uh, 5 meter, yeah? Okay, settle. Step 2, 
and then uh, using the first derivative test uh, det determines the relative extremum point, the relative maximum or the relative uh, minimum point. So you draw the tables. Uh, first here, uh, you put the value of x. Uh, first row, the value of x. And here, the first uh, derivative, uh, dy over dx. And the third row here, uh, the shape of tension. Yeah? So the value of x here equals to the 5, you put at the center. So from the left here, the nearest value equals to 4. And then here equals to the 6. Yeah? So you substitute this value into the first derivative and uh, determines the sign of the first derivative. So the first derivative here, when x here equals to 4, uh, sign here positive, uh, equals to 5, sign he, uh, this one equal to 0, and x equal to 6, the first derivative here equals to the uh, negative here. And you draw the shape of tension, uh, positive, uh, uh, increase, and then uh, 0 here, horizontal line, and the negative uh, decrease here, yeah? tangent here decrease, and then the conclusion U, uh, the relative uh, maximum here exists. Yeah? Okay, so uh, when x here equals to 5, so you find the value of y, and you substitute into the uh, y, so 10 minus x, and then uh, y here equals to the 5 meter here. Yeah? Okay, uh, this one, the first method uh, to find the relative uh, extremum point. Okay. Okay. And second method, uh, you can use to find the relative extremum point uh, using the second derivative test. Okay, the second derivative test, uh, you check the first derivative uh, equals to the 10 minus uh, 2x. And uh, you find the second derivative, uh, second derivative here equals to the negative 2. Yeah? So the sign of the second derivative here less than 0, or here uh, negative uh, sign so conclusion u the relative uh, maximum point yeah okay so this area maximum when x here equals to the 5 meter and then uh, you substitute and uh, find the value of y y here equals to the uh, 5 meter yeah Okay, uh, second method uh, to solve this question.
Okay. Uh, second method uh, to solve this question. Uh, first, you write down the perimeter here. 10 equals to the uh, x uh, plus y. Yeah. And the uh, first step using the second method, you write down the x here in terms of y. So x equals to the 10 minus y. And you substitute into the area. Okay. So you substitute into the area. Substitute here. Okay. And you write down the uh, area here in terms of y. Yeah. So this area in terms of y, uh, 10 uh, minus y uh, times uh, y. Yeah. And answer here equals to the 10y uh, minus uh, y square. Yeah. And uh, you find the first derivative uh, dA over dy in terms of y. And then uh, using the first derivative or the second derivative test determines the relative maximum or the relative, relative minimum point, step 4. And then uh, step 5 here, uh, you find the value of uh, x. Yeah?